Welcome to Shilin Night Market, the biggest night market in Taiwan. It's been here for a hundred years. Well, the original one was here for a hundred years, but they were scared that was going to burn down. So they rebuilt this one. So this is the slightly less flammable Shilin Market. We'll see how it goes. So close. What a violent machine. It's pretty cute. I used to play a lot of darts back when I was working in a bar. I'd probably clean up on that one. Probably not. I think there's some competitive mahjong going on. Now that one I wouldn't do as well at. You know tonight market when in the air you can smell stinky tofu which I'm not always happy about. The whole market is actually built around this temple. I want to be respectful but I also do want to go in. That's nice, it tells you who we're worshipping. The city guard. Good work. It's difficult to choose who to light an incense stick for. The celestial master sounds pretty good, but it would be hard to deny the holy emperor lord Guan god of wealth. I don't suppose that's how you're meant to pick who you worship. What a beautiful temple for that to be right in the centre of town, right in the middle of the market. I think I quite like that way of worship. I can't say I know much about it, but it seems to me that you can just be doing your own thing, not too pious, and then just pop into the temple. Do your thing for a few minutes, and then you're good to go. Oh. Just more food than you could ever eat in your whole life. Kind of wouldn't mind a tailored suit, but it would be one of these ones, let's be honest, if I'm going to get one. You might as well go all out. I'd look pretty good in one of those. I think it might be a matching game rather than actual mahjong. I would get my cards red, but let's be honest. It would only be profoundly bad news. I don't need to know. Look at the waddle on that one. That dog had the waddle that you could love for a lifetime. I don't want to just horse a whole bucket up the top row and try to win a bottle of whiskey. That's the strategy, right? There's just so much food in Taiwan. <laughs> I know I'm at where the food's at, but it's a lot. I'd love to have seen the old shilling market though. The one that was highly flammable. Are those little beat or nut keychains? Because that's pretty good, honestly. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I'm gonna try and win. This is gonna take me all day to use these. Alright, I'm getting pretty competitive now because I've not won anything and I really would like to win something. We'll see how it goes. Last one. Almost. I almost got it. Is what I'll tell myself. You get the elephant, or the cockerel, or the motorbike. Or the one that looks like a gun. <laughs> it's pretty twisty, turny, and paths, and all manner of stuff going on, all different places. But isn't this a wonderful side street? Well, that's a success. I found some ice cream and it's got peanuts in it. I just wanted that big block of peanut stuff just to take home and, you know, live with. 
and it's also got coriander in it. Not everybody wanted the coriander, but I thought if they're offering the coriander, I'll try it. I've never had cilantro and ice cream before, but what's not to like? Surely it's fantastic. I feel like having Pad Thai ice cream. Wow. Look at the size of those guys. Maybe this was the wrong turn to make. The guy that made them, I would describe his technique as slow and methodical. Yeah. I think it's like strawberry ice cream, maybe? I think I really like it. All right, that's it. This is really good. <laughs> it's making my teeth hurt a little bit, but... Could you just get coriander flavoured ice cream? I'd buy it. They aren't messing around when it comes to balloon popping. Jeez. Look at these things. I have no idea what's going on, but it looks fun. Whatever it was, he lost. But he took part. And in life, that is what matters. Which is why I'm having another go at the ring toss. Because I really want to win something. And I believe it to be possible. Behind the line? Yeah. Alright, we have a yellow line. Okay. I got something. I finally won something. Look at my winnings. <laughs> yes! Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> They've been out it a while, that's what I wanted to do. I'm so happy. <laughs> Thank you! I'm a winner. I have whiskey and a mixer. What more can you want? <laughs> Something pretty attractive about that, I'm not gonna lie. See what I start telling you? If you don't try, you don't get. Proof. 